Lord, thank you for this opportunity. We thank you for this day. Thank you for this moment. Thank you for this group of men that are in this room. Lord, I pray that you would give them the courage and strength to go out there and work hard tonight and give everything they have for each other, Lord. Thank you for the spirit of unselfishness. Thank you for just the opportunity to play another game. Bless both teams for many and Holly. Of course, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Northridge on three. One, two, three. Northridge! Coach, we are somewhere in Canada, a beautiful part of the country. I tell you, the greatest, most beautiful drive I've ever seen in my life. We're in a place called Squamish, yeah. I believe it is, yeah. uh, from Vancouver. And that was just an exceptional, extraordinary view, unbelievable. Very, very beautiful country. This could be heaven on earth, seriously. Yeah, it's that, it's that it beautiful. Was, it was like I was waiting for the Loch Ness monster to come out of the water. And it, was, it was awesome. Really, yeah. really a great ride. I don't know how many of our guys saw they were asleep on the bus. <laughs> but we coaches appreciate it. Yeah. Well, it was a great ride and also a good game for the batters tonight. There again, you had a chance to play everybody. And uh, this, this is really, once again, a team effort, team chemistry. Everything yeah. looked good tonight. Well, yeah, I mean, it just was, uh, I think the, the most surprising thing for me is how quickly these guys have picked up things and, and uh, have really bought into the idea of playing hard and playing unselfishly. And that's what I told them after the game, more important than winning the game, and just the way they're playing it. They're playing extremely hard. The guys are out there on the floor doing the things that we're asking them to do. And they're just willing to give up the ball. I think we had 33 assists tonight. Uh, and uh, that's just a good sign for us to be at this point right now. They, they truly don't care who scores. Uh, they're just playing hard together, making things happen, which is a coach uh, I'm pleased with. Now tonight, a uh, contribution to start the game from Trey Hale Emerson. Talk about his game and the fact that you've got guys you can count on. It seems like one night to the next night. Well, I mean, we've been changing the lineups up every half, actually every night, every half, just trying to get a chance to see how different guys play. And so that's why you see some guys up on some nights and maybe down on some other nights. But it is good to have that kind of depth uh, in the post where we can, you know, we can go with a lot of different combinations of guys, and, and these guys can score from the perimeter as well as on the inside. Trey shot the ball well tonight, hit a couple threes, and scored on the inside, had some great passes. So uh, he had a great game tonight. Now the, the, the old pro on the team is only a junior. Now he's he's the, like the grandfather. That's Josh Green. Yeah. Twelve assists tonight. He can score and he also can pass the ball a bit. Yeah, too. He just play, he's been playing great. Uh, since we've been here, showing a lot of leadership and, and just doing, um, you know, we know he can score, but he's taking some pride in doing some other things like defending and his assist and everything else. So we've been very, very pleased with his effort. Okay, one more game tomorrow night, but boy, this has been a great time for, for everybody. Yeah. It's been a wonderful trip, right? It has been. It's been a great trip all the way around, both on and off the floor. So we got one more to go. Got one more day. We're doing a sub suspension bridge thing tomorrow. Yeah. Be ready for the video for that. That's right. Uh, I won't be on the bridge, but plenty of players oh, will. Oh, yes, you will. Uh, but it'll be, a, it'll be a lot of fun, and I think our guys are, are uh, going to enjoy the last couple okay. of Coach, we'll see you tomorrow night. Hi, Thanks. Brandon. Second straight double-double. What are you thinking about this team and your role on the team, and uh, do you see this being a regular uh, out output? Um, I see my role just rebounding, mostly being a threat in the inside. Uh, definitely, I, I hope this can be my role during the, like the regular season, the real season, because I think I, I'm pretty good at it. So yeah. Now today you had 18 points, 10 rebounds, and two blocks. You haven't really gotten a lot of blocks the first two games. What made today different? Uh, right place, right time. You know, being the help side, being in position to block the shots. You know, uh, talking, talking on defense. That's what <laughs> that's what coach keeps talking about. Coach Morris keeps talking about. So he, he harped on that the whole time. All right, Brandon. Thank you. Thank you. Trey Hell Edmerson, 15 points, seven assists, three steals. You got off to a great start. Uh, first few minutes, you had about seven or nine points right off the bat. What do you think allowed you to do that? Uh, just good teamwork. The guys were passing the ball, finding me whenever I was open. I was trying to do the same thing. Uh, just meshed well together. It all worked out. Everyone hit the open spots. Now, we've been here for a few days, and uh, your overall stats seems like you're contributing everywhere. Is that the kind of player that you expect to be this year, or do you think there are certain strengths that we haven't seen thus far on the tour? Um, I pretty much do everything, rebound, pass, score a little bit, so I, I find myself all over the court. Yeah, that's what I do. I contribute everywhere. So. Now, how are you liking Canada? Uh, it's nice. It reminds me a lot of home. It's pretty, but it's also different at the same time. 
Oh, okay. And you're enjoying your time out here with the team, getting to know each other? Yeah, we're having a good time. Right okay, away. looking forward to the season. Um, what do you see that, that allowed you to come right in and contribute right away? Uh, basically, when I got in, I seen uh, that the teams, I mean, the starters started off active defensively. Um, the main thing is I wanted to do was come in and not, you know, let the level drop because of me or anything because that's noticeable. Now, yesterday you made a comment that you didn't have the game that you wanted. Is this the kind of performance that we can expect from you night in and night out, or do you feel like there are certain strengths that you just haven't been able to click yet uh, out here in Canada? No, it's nothing personal. Nothing personal. As long as we get the W, I'm satisfied with anything. Now, uh, your boy Brandon Perry had another double-double. What can you say about his game and, and what you've seen thus far from him? Hey, Brandon Perry, man, sweet feet. Nice footwork, nice touch for a big guy. Um, I didn't expect him to play this good this early, so it's like shocking to mostly everybody on the team. But um, I'm happy for him, though. Now, tomorrow we're going on the suspension bridge. You plan to cross that? No. I don't do heights. <laughs> all right, Trey, thanks. Hey, Lonnie, first of all, happy birthday. Thank you. And uh, what, what has it been like for you today, being away from home, but Canada, but you're with your team, and this has been a nice environment for you. Tell me about your day, your, and happy uh, birthday. I mean, being away from home, I wasn't really able to spend uh, my birthday with my family. I haven't seen them since July, but just being around my team, uh, with the coaches, just like a family environment. So it really wasn't too much of an adjustment. So it was just fun to just be out here, beautiful Canada and everything. And just happy birthday to you. And Coach Braswell said, hey, happy birthday. You're starting tonight. That must be yeah. a, a good feeling. How was that? To yeah, it was good to get out there, just play. We came out. I feel like we came out really competed. Uh, I feel like we executed well and just did everything right. We came out with a big victory, so that was great for us. Yeah. Now, it was your birthday. Did you talk with your mom and dad today? What was that? Did you talk with your parents? Oh, yeah, yeah, No, I haven't got to talk to them yet. I mean, since we can't call out here, I'm about to text them now. See if they're probably going to be asleep by now, so. Okay. They'll probably get in the morning. So let's put it this way. When you get back, you'll have another birthday. It's oh, yeah. Celebration. Hopefully. That's okay. Okay. From the team in Cal State Northridge, happy birthday. All right. Thank you, guys. All right, man. Thank